Welcome back to Let's Play Ghost of a Tale. I'm Burning Dog Face. And a little birdie told me that, uh, I might be able to find those crimson mushrooms I was looking for in a place I don't know that I ever would have looked. The sewers. Now I just need to remember how I get to the sewers, and I'll be fine! Come on, brain, you can do this. You got through college. I need to get down to the sewers anyway, to talk to Faustus for reasons. And to talk to... No one. I need to find the master symbol on the wall. Except I don't actually know what that looks like. Since this... Uh, the symbol out here in the thing looks exactly the same as this one. that. Huh. All your base are belong to us. Huh! Oh, that's right, I can't jump. I can, however, fall quite well. Is there an opposite to resting bitch face? I was just wondering if that's what Tylo has. That keeps him looking so... ooh-woo, even though he's had such a miserable life. Oh! Dui! You just go to the sewers. There was a key in... There was a door in the jail. I remember now. Huh. Flowers from Era still appears in the corner, but I do not see it marked anywhere. Boy, that's annoying. I noticed last time I could ask him about the key to the well. I just assumed I would come across that eventually, but, you know, let's see what happens when I ask him. I assume he'll just give me a number. Face of the... Yes, right. I had read that one. Eight. Seems to be rather a lot. He only charges two for information. Fine, fine, I'll do it. I did not mean to do that. Duck around the corner, and food is food, don't judge. Oh, embarrassing. Uh huh. Okay, you, 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 and you. Da, 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 da. Take the shortcut. Dwayne Lynn, can you give me a boost up there? I would really like to burn this flag of the legal government of the country you defended.
Ooh. Delicious food. Just growing on the walls. Two guys here. Where the fuck is this Autobot? Have you just been stuck on the level geometry or something since the last time I was here? Because I remembered I made uh, them chase me the last time I was here. You know, I think that might actually be it. As you will recall, it, to my great surprise, it remembered how much health a spider in the, uh... in the catacombs had when I get returned hours later with more ba bottles. This is... what? No, not slime. Why is slime the first object of my inventory? You know what? I do have a. There are a lot of supplies of sticks, so. There. Uh huh? Jim! I literally don't have enough sticks for all this. Suddenly realized that may have been a mistake. Because I think I need one. Oh, well, maybe I can use a bottle. Fingers crossed. Uh, I might have to jump cut here, you guys. Alright. Uh... Yeah! So yeah, apparently the crimson mushroom grew in the bones of that guy in the cage. You know, the one I knocked down hours and hours ago and then loaded because it felt really disrespectful? Right. Uh, is there more than one cage? I'm pretty sure... Like, I'm pretty sure the one I was looking for had a dead guy in it. Maybe there's more than one room. Ugh. Sorry, I just imagined the sensation of walking through sewer water in shoes that are open at the front. You're welcome. I hate you. Fuck. Those hunters from RDR could really learn a thing or two from Tylo. He doesn't even cry out. I'm not even sure he has a voice actor. I think the only characters that make vocalizations on the regular are Gusto and Fatal. Well, there's something in there. I might as well throw something at that and see what happens. Apple! That one doesn't feel so bad, because there was, you know, no one in it. But the one I was thinking of had, like, a whole skeleton in it. Spores.
Hang on, this looks like... Yeah! Well, I mean, I'm not happy that there's a dead man here. Rest in peace and all that. Uh, even the individual bones in his toes and tail haven't fallen off. This is a real shame. Um, with as little disrespect as physically possible, uh... Here you go. Ooh. Sorry. Crimson mushroom growing into dead bones of the dead man. There you go. Thank you, Internet. That one would have taken a while. I don't know that I would have gone back and opened that again. Worst part is, after I uh, saw that, I immediately remembered seeing Crimson Mushroom on the, uh, the pickup thing. I just... Uh... Well, that was before I had the quest, so you know that was me that was nothing to me. That's going to be what it feels like when I find a guy who says, I need you to find me a hundred bottles of rot gut. Okay, there was a way out of here. I think it was up past this. No, this leads deeper. But that's alright, because I need to go deeper anyway, because I've just remembered I need to talk to Faustus about completing the daytime mushroom quest. I'm down here. Fuck. Oh no, you know, you move. Right, I need to find the, uh, the cistern with all the leeches in it. I'm going to write this one off, to me, just having been a long-ass time since I was here. Uh, shit. I'll give them this. The thing with the mushroom wasn't so as, uh, you know, intensively hidden as the, uh, the spider in here. Hey, you don't have one of the guards, do you? No. Look to the spider nests. No, this is this time. There's a guy there. Sup? I'm Roger. Roger Stevens. It's a Captain America joke. Then, like a shrew representing the developer, shows up and tells that guy to shut his mouth and stop breaking the fourth wall. <laughs> By the way, speaking of Captain America, I happen to be filming this on the 4th of July, so, uh... You know, it won't be going out today, but, uh, happy belated Independence Day to all you... wonderful American Burning Dog fans out there. And since I didn't actually acknowledge it in a video, happy belated Canada Day to my fellow Canucks. I know there's a shortcut, I just don't remember where it goes. So I'm following the shiny lights again. Oh god, it wants to eat my legs! Ah! Jeez, it was right there. Goddamn leeches. Can I throw a stick at you? No. I should probably put this away. The alchemist is going to want to know how I got my hands on a dying light. Hey, boss. Uh oh, it it's you, Mouse. Are you all right, sir? Uh, sorry, I just got really weirded out there because his opening statement there gave me the same vibe as uh, someone wanting Senpai to notice them. Is the best way I can put that. 
I mean, I'm flattered, but, you know, I'm married. Well, Tylo is, anyway. <laughs> uh. Do you know, Mouse, why I'm here? Please, did you care to tell me? I was for many years the Baron's personal physician, the finest apothecarist in all of Muridia. Here we go, finally getting onto this guy, Baron Osdrick. Baron Osdrick is regional administrator of the former mouse lands of Muridia, and one of the five members of the Council of the Red Paw. Osdrick rose to prominence some 40 years ago during the failed Solitarian invasion when he su successfully rallied the Rat Guard. That was only 40 years ago? Wow following the disappearance of Roderick, the last Rat King, and led them to victory. Songs of his exploits during the invasion have done much to bolster his renown. Born in Meridia, the Baron has historically been broadly sympathetic to the plight of the mouse population and an advocate of increased autonomy for the region. However, following recent unrest in northern Meridia, Osdrick was summoned in to the capital for an emergency meeting of the five Barons of the Red Paw. Under pressure to suppress dissent to suppress dissent and restore order, Osdrick's guards began efforts to identify and arrest prominent figures in the emerging Meridian separatist movement known as the Sons of Asper. I wonder what that means. I just realized there's rust pitting on the side of his mask there. He has been wearing that for a very long time. Not necessarily like 24 hours a day, but no, he's had this thing a while. I sat in his court, and the noble rats of Pesa saw me as their equal, until one evening I was called to the Baron's chambers. It was a case of ringtail, nothing more serious than that. The ointment I applied as my own concoction. It had proven most effective in other cases, but alas. Right, yes. Baron lost his tail? I had no idea. Indeed. I imagine he wears a false tail now. The Baron was always rather vain. And so I was sent here to Dwainlin Heights, an opportunity to reflect upon my carelessness, the Baron called it. It wasn't long before the Jailer brought me to this chamber and put me to work. Huh. I wonder if that's supposed to mean his work is, uh, alcoholism. <laughs> no! No, that's right! Yeah, do you know why I am down here? To make rot gut was one of my options just there. I've served my sentence a dozen times over, but while there is another batch of rot gut brewing, the jailer and his master will never let me leave this place. Oh. Of course, but I would have thought you'd know that. Well, that's in a genuinely interesting twist. Uh, this whole time I've been assuming that uh, the Jailer found out something and the Master had him iced. What if he... What if the Jailer is the Master and that's why he's disappeared? Fuck you guys, I've got enough of a nest egg to put my feet up. The jailer is missing? I had no idea. The eight most common, I note. Out of the four rarest. Forgive me, but I should go. Yeah, okay. Fine. Fine! I One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, it's an ant. Why is their logo an ant? The termite's lair spreads far unseen. You must have spoken those words a thousand times to your comrades. Oh man, I... Because the only people the jailer would send to this guy would be people he knew he could control. <laughs> well, the truth is, Mouse, this is the Termite Slayer, and I'm trapped in it. Uh... 
thought this guy had a thing of oil lying around somewhere. Excuse me, boss. Ah. Don't mind me. Just uh, getting an old refill. Yes, that's right. There's an elevator, but where does it go? And for what would I need a stool? I kind of want to know if I can squish myself. So, I'm pretty sure those are the whiskers of uh, Tylo's model clipping through the mask. What I want to know is, uh... In-universe, are there little holes for the whiskers? Which would kind of defeat the purpose of a mask like this, but hey, it's the Middle Ages. Or... <laughs> did they put little... Oh no, it is full of holes, look at that. I was just wondering, did they put little whiskers on the mask so it would look like a more natural silhouette? You know, like I saw a guy once who, uh... He had some kind of horrible cancer on his face, and he lost his eyes and his nose. But he had this really elaborate, uh... prosthetic made up that gives him fake eyes and a fake nose so that people aren't horrified by what they see as the unnatural uh, presence of a man with a hole for a face. You know, I said it as a joke, but for an entire civilization of rodents, it might be really, really unnatural to see someone whose face does not have a bunch of whiskers sticking out of it. Consider, of all the species we've heard so far, I don't think a single one of them has been flat-faced. They would think humans are really weird-looking. Oh. Well, okay then. Taking a look. Okay, so now we know that their symbol is the termite. What was that quest that came up? Uh... Oh, uh... S search the sewers for the master's mark. That one. If that was an accident, that's where I found the ill bowl. I didn't know that it actually li listed that. Oh, right, I'm, uh... Fuck. I should know, fuck that. And the horse you rode in on, bitch! Oh no, it is nighttime. I don't need to sleep at all. I was about to double back to the bed. Can I drop down under the. No, I cannot. Shite. Okay. Fine, I will deal with all these assholes the same way I always do. Oh. Excuse me, pardon me. Hi. I'm a barrel. I'm empty. Come on, store stuff in me, man. You're breaking my balls here. If I had any. Um. Barrels not known for their enormous gonads. Ugh. <laughs> what the fuck am I even saying anymore? Okay, this is gonna be uh, very. Unnecessary of me. Let's see. 
Take off all of the thief things so that they don't recognize any of them when I come back later. Except that I have been wearing them for a while, but you know, whatever. Ooh, okay, it's a quick turnaround time. Psst, hey. Don't tilt your head like that, it's rude. Ahoy hoy. <laughs> Fatal takes a little bite of each of the ingredients, then chews. <laughs> I get that that's the sad face, but I like that it just looks like she just instantly fell asleep. Exhausted, the mouse falls into a restless sleep. the, uh... the other thing. Yeah, the, uh, the spyglass. That's what it was. Yes. And I'll have to go around in armor and talk to every fucking guard I can see and say the termite thing. But hey! It's a direction. Take me where I need to go. Uh, no, not, no, 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 not for the outro. Here we go. Ah, less creepy. Seriously, when I have the other one in my hand, sometimes I feel like I should be, like, saying something ominous in order to build up to the Undertaker's, uh, appearance in the ring. <laughs> I'm Burning Dog Face, and I will see you next time on Let's Play Ghost of a Tale. When we, uh, continue looking into this mysterious termite smuggling ring. Later. <laughs>